Hey friends, this is the, yeah, don't look at my hair. It's a beautiful day, but it looks like rain is coming. So I want to get a few things tidied up in the garden and I want to plant my parsnips and my carrots. They could have been planted long before now. I just haven't had the energy until now. So let's get some dirt from the pile using my walker and uh, maybe we'll pick up these two beds and put them where they belong. Hello Gacy. I don't know how well you guys can see because the sun is showing on my viewfinder. First things first. We're going to go into last year's dirt pile. I may not need dirt this year. Oh, Mr. Wormies. Now, this dirt is from a very old manure pile. I get a new one every year. I'm trying to make sure I get some worms here. Oh, I don't think we're going to need another load of dirt this year. Oh. oh. One more shovel full. Oh, should be enough. Plus the worms. We want the worms. Alrighty. Lots of worms. Alright. I'm gonna get oh, oh, my bucket here onto the walker, and we're gonna go over to the beds where I want to plant my carrots and parsnips. But, if I can see properly, I want to put those brown beds in the, uh, in the bin, if I can get it. My back is going to be feeling this. Oof. It's the uneven ground. If it wasn't so uneven, I wouldn't have to work so slow. So I put my bucket of dirt on this bed because I'm just going to plant my stuff and then just cover it. But here, I'm going to plant carrots in these two bins to the best of my ability. Here, we're going to plant oof, rainbow carrots. And we're going to plant the last of this little package of carrots just because it was open. I don't necessarily have to buy carrots, so it's um, I'll put them, oh, not lots of worms here. We'll put them in the beds that don't necessarily need anything, right? because I can always get deer carrots, I'm hoping. And the rain is about to come. Lots of worms in there. Let's work on this one. Get the dandelions out. Now, these are not just plain bins if you're new. These bins have broken holes and stuff in the bottom to let worms up through. So, uh, this one I don't think is going to need much soil here. Just want to make sure it's well fluffed up. We're going to put these Scarlet Nantes carrots in here. Gonna kind of move them all around and let the rain take care of the rest. 
Let's go do parsnips. Has anyone ever seen a black mushroom before on the ground? No, Gracie. Eggs and stuff. These are the parsnips that I harvested from the parsnips I grew the year before. And I've tested them, they do grow. Just gonna make sure there's lots and I'll thin them out later because I have lots. Just gonna cover them over. Oh, look at the worms. Gotta love the worms. This is called gardening senior style, folks. Buckets and walkers. With sweat dripping off your nose. You want to make sure that the birds don't see these seeds. And then try and eat them. I planted cabbage in here last year. And I don't have to label these bads. Why? Because I'm putting them on video. So if I have to figure out where I planted stuff, I'll just look at my video. But I recommend that you guys wouldn't be surprised if we got um, marigolds coming in here. Oh, there's my seeds. Get out of there, Gracie. I will I can always thin these, folks. Spread them out, make sure they go everywhere. Black flies and mosquitoes already. This is the Mrs. Wolfie from our half acre homestead saying carrots, parsnips. Mwah! Take care, God bless. That's your garden video. I believe it's number three. Love you guys.